Alright, so today's exam is not yet over because I decided to take a different approach and this time vlog before the exam because I'm genuinely excited genuinely che whatever, you know the word the one with the G um, I'm really excited for this exam because I don't know, I like, I, I like taking exams that's the, that's the fun part of studying ah, today has just been great uh, I woke up then I meditated for 15 minutes that's something I started um, but we can talk about that another day um, and then I studied, well then I had breakfast then I studied for an hour and afterwards I said yeah that's all easy I'm gonna nail this one uh, and I stopped studying and I just you know listened to music then I did a workout um, and then I took a shower and then I came here which is why you know my hair will look ridiculous now ah uh, yeah also my mood is highly dependent on weather and today's weather is just fine you know sitting here in a t-shirt enjoying the wind even though I have semi wet hair it's still not cold it's just awesome I was standing on my balcony today just relaxing completely naked being like oh yeah summer is coming oh it's almost sad that this one is the last exam for this semester and then I'm done boring oh, I like taking exams because I mean I don't like the studying for the exams and that's what people usually complain about um, but the taking the exam is really fun actually like I I, I, I like this part because you can prove what you know and I'm I'm one of those guys who are like yeah I want to be the best yeah I want to I want to show off um, and exams allow me to do that and so I like taking exams and the next one will be in like five minutes or so so I should probably get going but you know being on time is just fine <laughs> I'm already at the campus so what can go wrong right so um, I guess I'll see you after the exam to have a comparison of my mood before and after because before I was excited and afterward I'm totally exhausted because you know my brain has to work and it's not used to doing that <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah yeah it's it's fine I mean I it's okay that I didn't study so much today because after all you only have a certain amount of willpower per day and if I use it up for studying that's completely pointless because then I don't have any at the exam so <laughs> I had to wait <laughs> right I'm gonna see you right here in like two hours it went almost exactly as I said it would okay okay I need to stand up for that ah uh, Man, all right, okay, so I'm usually not the guy to leave early from an exam Because you know, I like to proofread, but this time I was just like, ah, my brain can't deal with this anymore Let's get out of here uh, Okay, here's the full story. Here's the full story. So the exam started at, f at 10 past 3 so 15 10 um, and the end uh, time was also written on the board 1710 all right so I don't know I, don't know. I, was, I just started with the, uh, the last question because it seemed like an easy one so let, let's just solve this one so I wrote it down da -da 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 -da. then once I was done I had a look at the clock a look at the board and I was like shit wait it's 40 now at 10 the exam is over and then I started to get stressed because like you know I spent half of the time for the one question but there are four questions so then I just I just started writing quickly still legibly but not as nice anymore and I just yeah, yeah let, let's get this done I want to answer all the questions because I want to ace this exam <laughs> so yeah basically I was just <laughs> uh, uh, I, I, I left the hardest part for for last um, and the first one uh, the first part question was uh, so I have never heard of this um, there, there were two circuits given and I should 
make a, a formula predicate logic which is unsatisfiable if they're equivalent. So I have never done this, but I was like, yeah, logic, I, sh I should be able to do this. Let's just, uh, I mean, there were ands and ors in the, in the circuit, so I, I can easily represent that in a formula. But then, okay, they should not be equal, so let's just say and not the other one. So then it should be unsatisfiable if they're equal, right? If not, then it's my logic fault, but I think that should work. Anyway, uh, so uh, then I also, un also answered this question and then for the last part, I had no idea this was a theory question uh, of two things I've never heard of. Um, so <laughs> I, was, I was having a look at the clock and it was 11 past, but nobody, nobody handed in their exam yet. Uh, it was the same thing with Sase. Nobody handed in the exam until the very last minute because it was just too much. And, and here the same thing, nobody handed in. So I was like, other people might have the same problem with the timing. But then I realized uh, the tutor he didn't do anything. He was just looking at his test and it was 11 past. And then I realized it was 11 past four and the exam stops at 10 past five and I'm like, no, but I was basically done. I was just missing this one question. Um, and then I thought about, at first I had a five minute break just sitting there doing nothing because I was like, whew, that was tough. Um, and then I thought about the question, okay, what could that be? It's something to do with uh, model checking. Um, what did he tell? I mean, they, they, the question was, what's the difference between word I didn't know and more words I didn't know? Um, so I just thought about, yeah, model checking. Hmm, what did he uh, talk about? And then in the end, I, I wrote something down with, well, the one thing uses breadth first search and the other one just uses depth first search. Yeah words um so yeah maybe it's that i have no idea whatever <laughs> but uh, the other questions should be fine and then i read through them again i didn't want to change them though it was it, it was really ugly i mean i changed one I, I, because i just wrote all over the sheet with arrows and shit um so i, I rewrote that one so it's legible and then i uh just had it in the exam because i was done but I answered all the questions basically uh, in half the time that I had. So I can be proud of myself. Uh, now I only need a good grade on that one as well. Then it will be perfect. Right. Okay, so that was the story of the verification and testing exam. Um, if I don't get an A, I'll do it again. Because, <laughs> I don't know, <laughs> taking exams is fun. So why not? Why not? Why not? And there's no... Uh, exercise part connected to that. I mean there is but it has a separate grade and I already get got an A on that one. Totally aced it. 110%. Ah, I'm so good. Right. Also it wasn't only my effort. It was also Lucas, a friend of mine that I did the exercises with. Anyway, done with exams for this semester. Um, looking forward to going to Bristol soon. I'll see you there. Make your backup.